Hi everyone! The US stock market closed the year of 2021 at elevated levels. The S&P 500 showed the strongest dynamic during the year. Perhaps one of the reasons behind the Santa Claus rally is investors' ambition to gain the highest profits at the end of the year. The US stock market grew roughly by 25% for the whole 2021. When it comes to forecast for major stock indexes, experts anticipate modest results in the new 2022. Besides, they warn that a large downward correction might be just around the corner. Let's discuss it in this video. On the first trading day of 2022, futures on the S&P 500 are still trading lower. The index viewed as a barometer of the stock market's health aged down by 0.25% to 4,766 points. The index is expected to trade in a tight corridor between 4,730 and 4,800 points. Currently, the S&P is a 3% above a 50-day moving average. Hence, the scenario of a large downward correction is feasible in January. Thus, investors are recommended to wait until the index retreats at least to a 50-day moving average before they enter the market with the long positions. The US currency perked up at the beginning of the year. Investors are looking forward to the minutes of the Fed's policy meeting. They want to check the meeting summary for policy updates that will be available on January 5. The US dollar index advanced against six rival currencies in early January. Meanwhile, it's a trading high at near 95.80. It's likely to stick to the upper border of the corridor between 95.50 and 96.10. The USD card pay is rising amid the firm US dollar. On other hand, oil prices are poised to extend its bullish trend, having rebounded off December highs. The rally in the oil market is putting pressure on the USD card pair. The trading instrument is currently holding at about 1.2680. Experts predict the corridor between 1.2600 and 1.2760, though the pair tends to stick to the lower border. Bitcoin has been trapped in a narrow range between $45,500 and $48,000 and $48, for the last five trading days, including today. Analysts do not see any market catalyst for a while. The overall sentiment is bearish. At present, buyers are not setting the tone in the crypto market, so it would be a wise decision not to enter the market without careful consider consideration. Do not allocate the whole deposit for altcoins. Make sure you hold a significant part of your portfolio in stablecoins. Market participants are alert to the first macroeconomic data, which is due in the first days of the year. On January 4, they will get to know the ISM manufacturing PMI for December. They will monitor U.S. unemployment claims on Thursday. The U.S. Labor Department is due to report non-farm payrolls on Friday. Both ADP national employment report and the non-farm payrolls might be very weak because of the Omicron outbreak at the end of 2021. Besides, the Fed's minutes could also trigger a large downward correction on Wall Street. Indeed, the regulator announced the timeline for monetary tightening at the policy meeting in December with the first rate hike in mid-2022. And that's all for today. See you tomorrow.